Alright, let's do this. What's up everyone? Empowered Qs here bringing you some more League of Legends action. We are going against a Riven in the top lane. So we are going super duper duper aggressive. Um, Riven's kind of interesting here. Um, she took Ignite as well. I feel like it's one of those that you got to commit to the aggressive gameplay to beat. So I'm going to rock out a little early push here. She took Ignite as well. Nice. Cool, got the flash. Awesome. Nice. So gonna look to potentially do a flash done Q kind of jump dealio in a second here. Nice, got my level two. Push this in and then go for scuttle. She could farm this just under wave, that's fine. Cool. Nice. All right, get the scuttle crab here. Her wave's gonna push. Cool. Nice. So good start, good trade. She's gonna life steal back a little bit, but that gives us a nice early advantage. Okay, and boom. nice. Alright, so she's level 2 still. she probably hit level 3 off this. Yeah, so we want to be careful. Once we get our level 3, like I said, we can look to all in because we are nice and super healthy. Um, the big thing about the Riven matchup is making sure you abuse her cooldowns properly. I want to get this minion down so I can hit level 3. Dead. Perfect. Push us in. She doesn't... Oh, don't miss it! She doesn't have um, teleport, so want to punish that and back. Nice. Yeah, as soon as she um, started attacking me in the wave, I knew I could get her within the um, the window here where she jumped out, popped my flash, guaranteed the stun. Super easy. Pop my ignite. Happy dead. That's going to use these so I stay super healthy clearing this wave and try not to miss any more minions. I think I'm going a pretty uh, standard Jax build too. Um, I think I'm going, let's see, does this get all the way? Yeah, cool. I think I'm gonna go Trinity into Sterix. Sterix is gonna help so I don't get bursted down by her combo. Um, then Titanic, then I might go Rage Blade. Could be fun. Uh, I'm gonna go a little bit of aggressive buy here and grab a Doran's Blade. That's gonna give me some life steal. Grab that and a Reju bead and do I go double long sword here? Go boots. I like that. I'm gonna grab boots and a control ward. That's what we're gonna do. Um, so probably have a little bit left. Uh, she didn't use ignite before, did she? No. Cool. So this is gonna hard push out to me. So we push it in a tower. We'll come back to a nice juicy wave. Happy day. So we got a lot of combat stats now, and she just has an extra long sword. So we got a little bit of life still too. That's gonna really help us out in lane. Cool. Um, I think I'm definitely gonna max out Q though. That'll help me keep up with her. Nice, get all my C, mmm, so good. There she is, so. It's not really a good idea to ever jump into Riven just because she has lots of stunts and disengages. So I want to wait for her to kind of use her cooldowns. Um, I could always proc my W and just instantly jump into her. Like, like so. That'll get a little bit of damage off and that kind of gets away her shield cooldown. Can walk this way because I have shorter cooldowns at the beginning of the game, especially before she gets any of her build off. So can really tease her off all this CS here. As long as I don't miss too many of my own in the process. So, don't want to let her get any of this. Zoner. We see Olaf. Nice. So the train I want to do now is one, two, and then jump auto attack to get my passive off. So, got a lot of lane dominance here. She's going to collect a lot on this wave when it hit, crashes into tower, but... Blue might be up, so I am going to roam into jungle. Oh, wow, bad control ward. 
I should have looked at her inventory and kept an eye out for that. Gonna proc this so no one can get it. I'm gonna get my favorite ward, which is right here, because it spots out Blue Buff and Gromp. Nope. Okay. And then I can walk up here, hit this plant. That's gonna mean Olaf can't use it. Olaf actually has no terrain, like clearing abilities. So. Cool. I'm cool with that trade. Oh my god, I. I clipped. I clipped. She walks up. Just give her a little love tap. Keep an eye out for Olaf. But she runs back in. Use my E. Nope. Cool. I think we could dive. Damn. We can push this tower. She has to leave. Make sure Olaf isn't there. Make her miss a lot of minions. Damn, I was just a smidgen off. Damn. Well, he got his flash out. I'll take that. Not bad. Back up. Go by. Then I'm going to get my uh, Sheen here for when I whack him with W. It's going to get all that Sheen proc damage. So I'm going to stay on the aggressive front here. And I'll get another control ward. You know what? I'm going to get a Rejuve Bead. Like I said, keep staying healthy. Uh, the Rejuve bead, bead is going to build into my Titanic Hydra anyways. So... Yeah, we know Olaf is right here. There's that ward right there. We could see this right here. So super, super good there. And my team know that... Ooh! Ooh! Oh, I thought they had that. I think she might have placed a ward right here. So I'm going to go check. Well, either she placed a ward or uh, a control ward or a regular ward. So I used my ignite there. See, look how much damage I do there now. Like, oh, I got the flash. Pop my potions. Got my flash. Nope, we're fine. Cool. What? What? I go bullshit on that. Damn, I was ticking my pots and everything. That sucks. All right, I got greedy on that one. Man. Did not expect her to do that much damage. Whoops! We're gonna ignore that play right there. Damn. That sucks. Really hope that doesn't cost me tower. Cost me a lot of minions. Jump to minions. Get back a little bit faster. Hurry it up. She might get first tower. That really sucks. Yeah, she's gonna get it. Well, got the kill back at least. Oh well, I'm still much stronger than her right now, so... Still got a nice CS lead. She got a little bit of catch up from, Well, she got a lot of catch up from that tower, which really sucks. You're riven and you're complaining about my cooldowns? Bitch, please. Clear this out. Hopefully I can match a little bit with uh, the tower. Okay. I should be able to get this. I'm Jack, so I take tower super fast. I need to get my ninja tabby so she can't burst me as easily. If I can get this tower, that's huge. That's a lot of catch up for me. Mid's gone, so I gotta be very, very careful. Yeah, I got this. Yep, I'm out. If I comes around, wait till my E's up and we could just chain. Uh, you wanna go? Surprise. 
<laughs> Change the CC, super easy. Oh my god. Good time! It's gonna get a really good buy here. I get my Phage and my Ninja Tabby. Perfect. Nice. I'm gonna start making my way to the bot lane. I uh, wanna extend my lead so we can either dive bot, get Infernal, one of the two. Uh, this wave is gonna push, so it either has to hit tower to bounce back, so just pushing past the river will do that, or someone's gonna have to come answer for it. So now here's the reinforcements. My reinforcements are gonna come. It's gonna be good stuff. Mm, I think we're okay just to take it. Oh, we wanna pull it out, yep. Well, my problem is Olaf's ultimate. Pop my potions. Nice. Keep popping potions. Cool. This ribbon. Too funny. Go team go. Nice. Man, I can't believe I died to that stupid early game uh, ignite. Uh, oh well. Oh. Get this out of the way. Clear that. Grab the plant and I could go clear top. Cool, so yeah, the wave bounce, like I said, we had about 40 seconds to make a play. We come back to this nice, super huge, juicy wave top lane. Which is exactly what we want. Nice. Cool. Do you want to make that same situation? Push it past tower, and then we can go make a play. So I'll probably clear one more wave. Then get out of here. Riven's actually bot, so. So I can actually push another wave or look to steal some jungle camps. Everyone's bot side. If blue's up, I'm going to take that. If not, I'll keep uh, pressuring tower. When you have an advantage, another good thing you can always do is... Is take away uh, resources from your enemy. So take away blue buff here. Go push that tower. Gonna wait here for a second. She walks back. Oh, lucky bitch. I'll just walk this way. Almost. Very close. I can go that way. Can I get... Yeah, get my Trinity Force. That's a huge item spike for me. Grab that. I'm going to start building towards my... I'm going to do Tiamat for Wave Clear and then Steric Gauge. That's going to be the plan. So the only person that's obnoxiously strong on their team is Ezreal. And he's going to be really hard because he gets a lot of kiting potential. So, got to be careful there. But other than that, I shouldn't have a problem at all killing this Riven. I got lots of vision over here. I still got my flash. So, gonna come back towards this wave. <laughs> gonna go around in this way. Oh, she just used her stun. Dead. Wait for the cooldowns. Easy peasy. Didn't even need my ignite. So, want to keep pushing my advantage here. I actually probably want to go bottom and start taking that tower. But, not in the position to do that at the moment. Oh, we got an Olaf. You don't want this Olaf. You don't want it. I don't have my ignite up soon. Cool. Back up. Toss is going over here. Ooh, punch him! Nice. Olaf left, so I'm gonna walk back. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> She's so mad. <laughs> ah, so mad! Alright, 
I can take this tower. Oh my gosh, Olaf, go away! They take this jungle camp. Gotta be careful, because I really wanted uh, my uh, ignite for Olaf. How strong is he? He's not very strong. Oh, nice! They should let me buy. Ooh, I know what I should do. I should take this. That's what I should do. I have a control ward. Nice. Alright, just walk around it. Get the eye proc. Whoop. Come on, Shelly! Pop my post. Just stay healthy, and then I'll go bottom. Nice. I don't want it. I can't ward hop. Alright, Infernal Drake. So I want a clear bottom for that. Grab this. Grab this. Headbot. So this wave is going to keep pushing. So I should be able to do Infernal and then go back to the top lane. Uh, we want to get the Rift Scuttler that's over there. And uh, we can force down tower then. Ezreal could split too because he has teleport. So I see Olaf and Ezreal. Like I said, Ezreal's the one that I'm worried about. Nice. Alright, get a ward down over here. Oh. I can clear this really quickly. Riven's top. Push down this tower. They just warded right there. Get my attack speed up. I'm not worried about you. Oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm dead. Save me! Woo! Pop potions, get out of here. Oh my god, my game is lagging. Lag! Lag! Make it stop! I'm the one who killed her too. I am so sorry about that. There's so much going on. Make it stop. Calm it down. I can solo it. No worries. So, in a different world where that would have broken out a little bit faster, I can still get Dragon and clear this huge wave. So not all of it will be there, but a lot of it will. Man, what is going on with my game? I am very sorry, guys. So, get this. You know, I feel like this always happens to me where I build up towards Sterix, but it just makes so much more sense to buy the straight-up completed item. Um, like, what's better? A fully completed Titanic? Or, um, Splitting Bottom? Or a partially completed stair. So that's really what it comes down to. Like, I always end up with, like, 2,100 gold where I'm, like, 900 off from building my stair. And, like I said, it just doesn't make sense to uh, not finish the Titanic. Oh, there's it. Woo! Ezreal. Getting away. Echo is so sticky, though. Well, they're all over here. I'm going to push and force someone back. Riven, I could just all in. Man, I wonder... I do wonder what the heck's going on with my game. I see three mid. So, push this in. Back it up. That's the one thing you got to keep in mind with splitting. you got to be very, very aware of your surroundings and where everybody is. So while they're rotating and doing this, I could take a jungle camp. Okay. Level up. Level 14 to level 10. Woo! <laughs> yeah, she could not even think about fighting me. My flash is going to be up. Nice. Oh, 
Whoa, hold on. Oh, she flashed at the same time. Run away. Wait till my E's back up. Pop my potions. Nice. Echo's got him. Two. One. Jump. Boop. Easy peasy. Let me jump too. It hurts. The lag hurts. Oh my god. Man. This ribbon. Not so good. <laughs> Alright. We can clear this. God. Poor Riven. Wow. I could pre- Damn! <laughs> What's my hysterics? 32? Is that enough? Uh, don't look. I'll wait the 20 gold. Don't look. You didn't see anything. <laughs> I mean, I could go fully... I, I'm tempted to just go Rage Blade, but... I will build Rage Blade next, so... Trinity, Titanic, Sterics, Rage Blade. That's what I like. I may grab a, um... A gun blade if the game goes that long, which... Honestly, it should not. But... It just should just be barren top and end. Cool. Yeah, just go top after this. Take down the Baron. Nice. Head to the top lane. Oh, sorry, my bad. Yeah, use your... Get this tower for free. Ooh, I got Knight's Vow. Happy day. Yeah, they're all gonna have to be at base because of the minion waves. Could take this very easily. Cool. All my attack speed. Easy. Ow. Ow! Just wait for uh, Leona to stun. Oh, I missed my stun. Woohoo! Woohoo! He did! You did! <laughs> Gee! Gee! What's up? Silly Riven. Tricks are for kittens. Man, oh man. Give it to that Vi. My one death was that stupid Ignite that I miscalculated the, uh, the damage on right away. Woody S! Let's check out the damage charts. Echo's still putting in some darn good work. Uh, well, hopefully that wasn't too laggy on your guys' end. If it was, I super, super apologize. But it didn't lag until some of the crazier team fights with a lot going on. Never usually happens to me. But, yeah, the big thing about uh, the Riven matchup is really, really baiting out the cooldowns. Um... It's just not a good idea, like I said, to jump into her. It's a matchup you have to play a little bit more passively. Luckily, traditionally, Riven players, very, very aggro. So as soon as she uses like her third Q to jump, she loses a lot of her disengage ability. So I walk in with my E. If she stuns me, I can jump on her, proc it, get a lot of damage. Uh, made some spicy roams and stuff like that. Got the early scuttle crab. All that good jazz. Well, I hope you guys liked that one. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. All that good jazz. Tune in next time. Peace.